Hello, Dan Riemann here with the weekly update. It's been a great first week back from break. Uh, the numbers in the West Hempstead community regarding COVID uh, were a little bit higher at the beginning of the week than they are at the end of the week. So that's good news. Have to say, love to see all the great smiling, beautiful and handsome faces throughout this district. Learning continues in all ways, shapes and forms and I'm proud to be a part of this community. You may have heard some news yesterday. Uh, some politicians were here yesterday uh, promoting their UPK initiative. It is exciting, but I do want to clarify a few things. Number one, pre-K has always been on our agenda. We now have the opportunity to do it, but this opportunity began when the bond was passed. If you're not aware, there's been three phases to the bond. We're up to the last phase, also known as Project C. And in Project C is um, the part where we build five pre-K classrooms. So this was always in the works and I wanna thank the Board of Education for their unwavering support. It was really their idea, uh, spearheaded by the president of the Board of Education. And now it's coming to fruition. As you know, with construction, things take time. The plan is for construction to be completed sometime in September, hopefully sooner. But again, I'm just going to say it's construction. With that being said, we are one of a number of districts throughout Long Island who have received monies for UPK. But I want to be perfectly clear. We have not seen final documentation on expectations, rules, and regulations. Until we do, we cannot make any decisions. Regardless of what occurs with the UPK money, we will be moving forward and building a pre-K program. We know how important it is. This year even showed it more with families who have been nothing short of fabulous and contributing to their child's education. And uh, we, sh we have always known the need to have some of our youngest learners here with us. If you're not aware, 50% of our kindergarten uh, does not attend preschool. And so we find this to be a very important idea and an important initiative. We will await further guidance from the state before we make any further decisions. Thank you so much. Be well, be healthy, be safe, take care.